Hello students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com. My name is Ramandeep Singh and in the series of providing important session for SPM CIL, SPM CIL, SPM CIL, Assistant Manager Marketing, Assistant Manager Marketing exam. So important session for Assistant Manager Marketing exam. Today we are going to do types of marketing. This is a very important topic, very important topic. Hai. So we'll learn various types of marketing, very easy topic, you'll see questions from these topics, this particular topic in your exam. So stay tuned. So before starting, let me tell you, we are doing a proper course for SPM CIL assistant marketing manager exam. So we are providing the complete syllabus coverage along with the live session, recorded session, study material, quizzes, full and test series and interview preparation guidance. Everything is available on bankexamstudy.com. Links are available in the description. Link to join the course is available in the description. You can check the description to find the link. So traditional marketing as the name suggests, uh, making use of traditional marketing methods to market your products, right? To market your brand or product, okay? जो भी चला आ रहा है टीवी पे आर्ड देना राइट जो भी टीवी पे प्रिंट पे बिलबोर्ड्स सो दिस इज ट्रेडिशनल मार्केटिंग जो ट्रेडिशनल मेथड्स यूज करते हैं आप दैट इज ट्रेडिशनल मार्केटिंग ओके आउटबॉन्ड मार्केटिंग आउटबॉन्ड इट इज एन इंट्रूसिव प्रमोशन सच एज प्रिंट एड्स आप सी इनबॉन्ड एक फर्क समझ लीजिए व्हाट इज इनबॉन्ड एंड व्हाट इज इनबॉन्ड एंड व्हाट इज आउटबॉन्ड इन बॉन्ड मीन्स कस्टमर्स आर कमिंग टू यू कस्टमर्स आर कमिंग टू यू आउट बॉन्ड मीन्स यू आर गोइंग टू कस्टमर्स आप कस्टमर्स के पास जाके अपने प्रोडक्ट को पिच कर रहे हो अ गुड एग्जाम्पल इज हेल्थ इंश्योरेंस अ गुड एग्जाम्पल इज हेल्थ इंश्योरेंस इफ हेल्थ इंश्योरेंस एजेंट इज कमिंग टू योर ऑफिस योर होम दैट इज आउट बॉन्ड मार्केटिंग फॉर देम बट इन केस यू आर लुकिंग फॉर Uh, a health insurance plan and you go to google you go to policy bazaar you go to icci or hdfc ergo's website you put your number and then they contact you then that is inbound marketing okay so if customer is approaching the brand is approaching the company that is inbound marketing and if the company is contacting the first contact is made by the company or the brand that is outbound if first contact is made by the customer then that is inbound marketing okay so the same sell customers additional product and services they don't have uh, when they contact you okay so the customer is contacting you outbound you are contacting the customer inbound the customer is contacting you digital marketing what is digital marketing making use of digital media uh, making use of internet uh, द प्लेटफॉर्म विच डिडेंट एग्जिस्ट इन द पास जो पहले एग्जिस्ट नहीं करते थे यू आर मेकिंग यूज ऑफ डिजिटल यू नो मीडिया यू आर मेकिंग यूज ऑफ इंटरनेट टू प्रमोट योर प्रोडक्ट्स टू प्रमोट योर ब्रांड दैट इज डिजिटल मार्केटिंग फेसबुक पे आप एड देते हो गूगल एड्स पे आप एड दे रहे हो दैट इज डिजिटल मार्केटिंग ओके यू आर लैवरेजिंग सर्च इंजन सोशल मीडिया ई मेल्स इवन एस बी आई इज डूइंग इज डूइंग इट एच डी एफ सी सारे लोग अभी कर रहे हैं बड़ी कंपनीज कर रही हैं दैट इज डिजिटल मार्केटिंग वट इज सर्च इंजन मार्केटिंग वेन यू मेक अ गूगल सर्च अबाउट अ प्रोडक्ट फॉर एग्जाम्पल यू सर्च फॉर अ टर्म हेल्थ इंश्योरेंस आप करके देखो हेल्थ इंश्योरेंस हेल्थ इंश्योरेंस सो यू विल फाइंड सम वेबसाइट्स राइट सो वट इज सर्च इंजन मार्केटिंग you are basically trying to you know move your product at the top aap chahte ho ki aapka brand aapka product jo hai aapki website top pe aa jaye that is what you are looking for that that is what that is search engine marketing right aap apni visibility badha rahe ho search engine pe what is content marketing uh, very common actually uh, with the help of content you are promoting your products so hair loss uh, products hain hair लॉस प्रोडक्ट्स हो गए वेरी कॉमन एंड इवन फॉर द यूनिवर्सिटी सम प्राइवेट यूनिवर्सिटीज प्राइवेट यू नो कॉलेज दीज आर सम ऑफ द इंस्टीट्यूशंस और द ब्रांड विच आर यूजिंग द कॉन्टेंट मार्केटिंग न्यूज पेपर में आपने देखा होगा देर इज देर इज एन आर्टिकल विच इज एक्चुअली स्पॉन्सर्ड बाई सम प्राइवेट कॉलेज और सम यू नो 
सम कॉस्मेटिक प्रोडक्ट और सम यू नो इंस्टीट्यूशन राइट दे गिव यू इंफॉर्मेशन दैट यू शुड डू मास कम्युनिकेशन में मास्टर्स राइट एंड देन इट इज़ प्रमोटेड बाय अ प्राइवेट कॉलेज यहाँ से कर लो एंड दिस इज़ आर कॉलेज दैट इज़ कॉन्टेंट मार्केटिंग यू आर यूजिंग द कॉन्टेंट आप आर्टिकल्स और ऐसे लगा रहे हो आर्टिकल्स और ऐसे हैं एंड उसमें आप अपना प्रोडक्ट ब्रांड जो है मार्केट कर रहे हो सोशल मीडिया मार्केटिंग प्रमोटिंग योर प्रोडक्ट विद द हेल्प ऑफ प्रमोटिंग योर प्रोडक्ट विद द हेल्प ऑफ सोशल मीडिया प्रमोटिंग योर प्रोडक्ट विद द हेल्प ऑफ इंस्टाग्राम फेसबुक राइट आप ऐसे प्लेटफॉर्म्स पे अपने प्रोडक्ट्स को पिच कर रहे हो दैट इज सोशल मीडिया मार्केटिंग एंड देन वॉट इज वीडियो मार्केटिंग वेरी कॉमन आई होप यू हैव सीन स्काई शॉपिंग आई मीन आई हैव सीन दैट स्काई शॉपिंग टी वी एटीन दैट दैट वॉज वेरी कॉमन टी वी एटीन स्काई शॉपिंग एंड नाउ देर आर मेनी यू नो पीपल हु आर प्रमोटिंग दे प्रोडक्ट्स ऑन यूट्यूब राइट सो वीडियो मार्केटिंग देर आर आर लॉट ऑफ हेल्थ केयर यू नो कंपनीज हेल्थ केयर प्रोडक्ट्स दे आर टेलिंग यू द बेनिफिट्स आई मीन आई हैव सीन मैनी दे दिल टेल यू द बेनिफिट्स ऑफ अश्वगंधा दिल टेल यू द बेनिफिट्स ऑफ एलोवेरा राइट एंड देन दिल टेल यू वी हैव द बेस्ट एलोवेरा बाय दिस दिस इज आर नंबर बाय दिस राइट सो दिल टेल यू देर इज फैटी लीवर हो जाता है एंड हाउ टू क्योर द फैटी लीवर ईट द एलोवेरा कैप्स्यूल्स एंड वी विल प्रोवाइड यू द बेस्ट कैप्स्यूल्स राइट so that is that is video marketing this video i mean this uh, demo session is sort of video marketing i am teaching you i am trying to tell you the quality of content that we provide uh, and uh, you know we are going to cover the entire syllabus uh, in in the course i mean uh, if you like the content a lot of uh, students are going to like the content a lot of won't like it but uh, at the end of the day students will buy the courses right so that is video marketing okay what is email marketing uh, check your uh, email inbox you what you will find that uh, you might be getting a lot of emails uh, from various companies even bank exams today we we send emails right you go to a website you register yourself and then we know a lot about you right so if you if you go to bankexamstoday.com and if you take a trial of i let's say for uh, ibps uh, so marketing so let's say you you took a trial of ibps so marketing course right now we know that uh, you are an mba marketing we this is a rough idea if you are taking a trial of ibps so marketing we get an idea that you are uh, an mba marketing you are somebody who who is around 25 to 30 years old right uh, somebody who lives in india i mean maybe 98% of the time we are correct 2% of the time we may be wrong sometime people are just doing it uh, anyways okay and you are actually uh, active online somebody who is taking trials of online courses they are active uh, active online right so this is the data that we got and then we got your email uh, we got your name and sometimes we we take your mobile number we stop doing that sometimes we get your mobile number as well so a lot of data we are getting right so and then uh, the active last active we we get this data as well last active when uh, when you got active on our portal right so using this data we can you know uh, we can market our products that okay i mean in last 3 months all these students i mean we we get uh, A very uh, you know small number of students like 300 400 students and we'll we'll send our uh, email that we have started it and you are eligible apply for it and take the course it's win win situation you get an idea okay this is a course we teach you so it's a win win situation for everybody so buzz marketing creating a buzz right so it's a viral marketing strategy so uh, many times there is a buzz around a lot of things so if you have seen the squid games series you might have noticed that everybody was wearing vans shoes vans is a brand it's a shoe brand uh the white vans there was a shortage of white vans right everybody was buying white color vans because uh, all over the world it, it was a huge hit and there was a buzz about this particular brand this particular uh, kind of shoes of this brand white vans so people were buying at that influencer marketing Uh, a lot of technology mobile uh, you know companies they are doing it except apple uh, you might have seen the motorola ads on uh, youtube uh, some youtubers are promoting a product saying this is the best product although it is not uh, so that is influencer marketing 
paying the influencers big youtubers big uh, instagram uh, you know in uh, 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 personalities to you know pitch your product to tell everybody the features of your product to tell everybody that our product is best so that is influencer marketing contextual marketing uh, it's not very common nowadays but still on uh, if you if you're reading a blog on bankexamstudy.com right you might have noticed at the end of every you know uh, in between uh, links are there so links are there which will take you to the courses that okay uh you have gone through the banking awareness article we have a course for banking awareness and that that will cost you 500 rupees a lot of people are going to buy that okay if 1000 people are reading it maybe 5 4 3 people are going to buy it okay brand marketing you are not promoting a product you are basically promoting the whole brand so the good example is there was an ad uh, by tata in which the, the Tata is, uh, you know, promoting the whole brand. They are making the public perception that, uh, see, what is the perception about Tatas? That they are honest, they are credible, right? Uh, what is the, you know, opinion about Reliance? People, people are having opinions about brands. There is a brand perception about Tatas, about uh, Reliance, about Birlas, about HDFC, right? About SBI. People are having perceptions. Think about it. You are having perception about each and every brand in your mind. The Tata, it's an honest company. Reliance, not so honest, right? Uh, SBI, very huge bank backed by the government, safest bank, right? Uh, HDFC, the biggest bank in India, uh, biggest private bank, private lender, right? safe uh yes bank not so safe right now this is a perception in the mind of the common man yes bank not so safe right so uh there are perceptions hero motors so what is your perception perception about the hero motors low cost bikes good quality low cost bikes right uh, royal infield re uh r like uh you know good quality costly bikes right Cruiser bikes that that will come to your mind. Maruti, uh, Maruti Suzuki. Uh, right now it's only Suzuki. What is the perception? Uh, like reliable cars. That's in your mind. Okay. So there is a perception about each and every brand. With the help of brand marketing, you are, uh, you know, you are shaping the people's perception. Okay. Gorilla marketing. So you are placing bold, clever brand, uh, you know, billboards uh, on the high traffic physical location. So you might have seen some billboards. Uh, the most clever one I have seen was by the Burger King. That was, I mean, you can make a Google search about it, right? The billboards, the clever billboard, make a Google search, the clever billboards make a google search about it you will get a, a good idea that there are various brands audi is a very good example uh, i have seen some billboards which were very very creative right so they are uh, trying to you know catch the uh, the eyeballs of the uh, of the people affiliate marketing so uh, amazon is using this uh, strategy so what amazon is doing amazon is uh, you know giving commissions so let's say I also have the affiliate um, you know, account of Amazon. Right now I'm not promoting any product, but I used to do that. So uh, whenever, uh, see what Amazon does is they give me a dashboard. So what I can do is, let's say I made a video about five best books for RBI grade B or five best books for IBPS PO. I'll generate links from Amazon, from my dashboard. That would be custom links and that would contain my affiliate code. Whenever you buy the link, uh, whenever you buy the books from my code, I'll get 10% of the sale amount. 10%, 5%, 3%, 2%, depending upon the products. On mobile phone, it is 1%. On books, it is 10%. Okay. That is affiliate marketing. You know, uh, Amazon is using it. Flipkart is using it. Account-based marketing, it is hyper-focused. So, uh, you have seen accounts, right? Uh, I mean... In case of big ticket uh, services, for example, uh, hosting, web hosting, where we host our, uh, you know, websites and projects, uh, the hosting companies, they, they, they know our needs, exactly they know our needs. So they pitch the products according to our needs. 
IT companies, they pitch the products according to our needs. That is account based marketing. Word of mouth marketing, very common nowadays. Uh, there is a kind of product, uh, you bought a product online, you liked it and you, you tell this to your friend. And then a good example would be uh, Sketchers or Asics in India, right? Uh, Asics or Sketchers. See, a lot of people are buying Asics or Sketchers. I mean, they are very, very popular brands in India now. Uh, see, you will see a lot of um, ads for um, Puma or... Uh, uh, adidas or nike on online or even on um, on tvs and all um, even on the web but there are very few ads for asics or for uh, sketchers right but still people are buying it because of the quality i mean people i mean i, I personally use those products these products so somebody used it and he told me that it's really good give it a try okay i use the same okay i liked it i tell somebody else okay it's good try it and that is word of mouth marketing okay Relationship marketing, most of the times, a uh, very common example would be banks. In the banks, there are relationship manager. They have contact with the, with the customers, direct contact with the customers, and they pitch the products according to the needs of the customers. If I need, uh, I have a, you know, relationship manager. Uh, that relationship manager would uh, recommend me various products, health insurance, or maybe term insurance or fixed deposits or whatnot, uh, lockers and everything. He'll, he'll recommend me the products. Obviously, he has targets, but he'll recommend me the products. Okay. So that is relationship marketing. You build a relationship and then you, you sell your products. And what is remarketing? Very common. Uh, let's say you, uh, you make a Google search. You make a Google search for Woodland Shoes. Woodland Shoes. You went to their website, you saw that and uh, you didn't make the, the purchase, okay? You said, okay, a change shoes, I will see you Next day, you come online, you read a blog or you go to YouTube, you'll see the advertisements for Woodland Shoes, okay? Now, Google got your data. Google knows that you are looking for shoes. They know your budget. They, they know your age. They know your gender. They know you like tan color shoes they know you are looking for tacking shoes uh, and then they'll show you the similar products and they'll keep on showing you till you buy some shoes so that is that is remarketing they'll they'll show you the same ads again and again so google is having a lot of data that is remarketing it's very powerful uh, you know uh, tool by google event marketing you organize an event to promote your products, to advertise your products. A uh, good example is there are various wedding, uh, you know, uh, wedding events in, in many cities where, I mean, bridal events are there where they showcase the cosmetics and clothes and whatnot, uh, a lot of products that, uh, you know, female you, females, they use it. So there are events in the five stars. So that is event marketing. The brands are trying to promote their products, okay? Cause marketing, this is a, a corporate CSR kind of a thing, right? That aims to, you know, improve the society and telling society that we are working for a cause. A company is actually working for the society and it is actually telling the society that, see, we have done this so that there is a perception, they can make a perception in the mind of, uh, you know, community or the society that we are a good brand, right? So let's say uh, Tata's, they, they make a college, Tata ka, uh, test has, for example, they tell everybody, see why uh, the name test is there, why the, the Tata's, they can, you know, use any other brand, they can use Mahatma Gandhi Institute of Social Sciences, why Tata Institute of Social Sciences, why the name Tata is here, why? Because they want to tell everybody that this is the, you know, amazing college that we have built and the high quality students are there and the alumina is working really great and uh, you know the the money that you are paying for the products the the money that you are paying for the tata car we are investing a part of that money in colleges in hospitals right in tests we are investing and it is helping uh, the society so that is cost marketing okay controversial marketing uh, very common nowadays creating controversies right uh, to 
to actually pro, uh, to promote your brands to grab the attention many people does that there are endless ways to you know uh, to in- create controversies there there was a movie called kashmir files i guess kashmir files there was a controversy around this movie and trust me this was the highest grossing movie in the year uh, grossing hindi movie in the year 2021 right so the highest collection most profitable movie because there was a controversy around this movie right so it was uh, around a sensitive social issue so that there was a controversy so the makers they knew that there would be a controversy they knew that they let people speak about the controversies and they made a lot of money out of it what is seasonal marketing see there are uh, certain products which can which are bought in a particular season for example kites uh for example firecrackers uh firecrackers for example christmas trees christmas trees these are rakhis these are some of the seasonal products so seasonal marketing is done for this these kind of products scarcity marketing see uh when actually you know uh there is a kind of scarcity in the market shortage of certain products there is an expectation that in the future is particular product ka shortage ho jayega there won't be this product won't be available in the future so people they 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 start uh, you know uh, you know hoarding the products at the time of covid 19 uh, lockdowns people started hoarding the uh, tissues right they started holding salt they started holding food items so that that was a thing scarcity was there so people in the fear of missing out they they try to hoard the products right and then targeted marketing is a marketing that is extremely focused on a well defined audience ek you know exactly so uh, for example uh, kinder joy kinder joy is a very good example so they are targeting the kids up to the age of 6 years up to the age of 6 years and their marketing is very targeting they place advertisements on uh, cartoon network or you know they they exactly know where they should pitch their products so that is targeting marketing transactional marketing when you are actually making the transaction uh there are companies for example google pay they give you coupons they give you coupons they give you discount uh, discounts uh, that you can use later on for example whenever you make a google uh, pay payment they give you mintra uh, you know uh, coupons right so you shop for uh, uh, 2000 rupee then you will get a discount of 300 rupees right so do you know that google google is actually making money out of it right so if that is happening mintra is making sale and mintra is going to pay google pay for the sale that is transactional marketing and what is viral marketing it is similar to buzz marketing the name is similar to buzz marketing so you make your customers talk about you right uh, so you in so your customers are talking about you and that is helping your brand so that is viral marketing when people they start talking about you that is viral marketing right augmented marketing provide additional services amazon ka amazon prime is a good example you are providing additional service value additional services uh, innovating uh, innovative offerings to customers to increase their level of satisfaction amazon prime is a good example you are giving uh, you know access to new movies you are giving to webs access to web series two days shipping so that is innovative kind of a product so that's augmented marketing and what is drip marketing so i have used it in past so basically what you are doing is uh you write an you know a set of emails right so when you go to you know bankexamsada.com so on day 1 you will get an introductory email that thank you for signing up this and that and day 2 we'll send you some free stuffs download this check the quality on day 3 maybe we'll give you access to a free class attend this class and on day 4 may we will ask you to join a particular course so join this course okay and day 5 if you have not joined the course we will 
give you maybe a coupon code okay just take 10 percent discount maybe you'll be interested and that's all that's all we will send you just five emails that is drip marketing okay and database marketing as i told you uh everywhere wherever you fill your email id and wherever you give your mobile number people they the companies have your data and they exactly know that you are a student you are you know preparing for a particular exam what are your qualifications uh on on the basis of your needs the companies are going to send you emails they know exactly what you are looking for so that is database marketing okay and what is loyalty marketing so uh grow and retain existing customers through incentives so uh reliance card is a good example reliance loyalty card is there starbucks very good example so there is a you know uh, starbucks give you free coffee right i mean for stars right so when you uh, pay via uh, the starbucks app the starbucks give you uh, stars right so that is a loyalty plan and you can redeem the stars with the coffee free coffee actually so that is a loyalty marketing right and students ask your doubts in the comment section in case there is any doubt kuch bhi aapko samajh mein nahi aaya to ab apne doubts poocho i'm going to answer your doubts and spm cil assistant marketing manager uh the classes we are doing it on bank exams today.com we are covering the entire syllabus live session hai recorded session study material quizzes full length test interview preparation guidance everything is in is included in the course just go to bank exams today.com aap free mein uh, you know ek bar demo bhi leke dekh dega leke dekhiye this is a free demo actually and you can join the complete course we are covering the entire syllabus so list of our students who cracked the previous exams using our study material and kuch bhi agar aapko samajhna aaye you can drop a whatsapp message 9067201000 this is my personal whatsapp number where you can actually ask your doubts and i'm going to answer your doubts that's actually all for today students thank you and have a very nice day bye bye